Hi everyone. So I am back with my new tutorial again. In this, I have created a simple product modeling of a hand wash, a baby hand wash. So this will be a simple tutorial. So hope you like my video and please watch till the end. And thanks. So move on to our general now. Delete these now. Select a cylinder. Keep its vertices on twelve. Now go to edit mode. Now just arrange its shape as we are making the bottle part of our hand wash. Now control uh, press control B and then you can bevel it and drag your mouse for arranging the uh, this edges. Now delete this face li like this. Now from bottom part also give it some shape by extruding it inside and beveling it, uh, beveling the edges like this. So now select these edges and press E and Z here like this. Now select these again. Control B for bringing the curviness onto that. Now let's add some loop cuts uh, over here like this. Now let's make it tube part means the cap part. Now separate that like this. So here press S for scaling it. And you can see now select it now from here you can also go and uh, bring a spear here for giving it some extra uh, shape as I am requiring otherwise you may keep it as still it is as simple you want just now press ctrl J for uh, grouping those now press M and then select on at center and repeat that for every part here like this for every vertices uh, uh, do the same so you can see now delete this upper faces again now select these now keep it little down so this is a tube part means the cap part sorry so we are making that add some loop cuts over here like this so you can see we have made till here now smooth shade it properly press ctrl 1 for uh, adding some subdivisions now you can uh, go to on this part and arrange its thickness like this apply it now add some loop cuts tool uh, over here to maintain these sharpness like this so as you can see wherever it is requiring you have to add uh, that so after that after completing this now let's uh, make some more parts of it so go to add mesh then select a plane now press 7 for top view or now press tab for edit mode now just mirror it from here like this uh, add some uh, vertices or loop cuts for making uh, for giving it a nice shape as you require actually I have speed up my video for not getting you bored uh, so like this so this is a quick video on basic modeling of a simple hand uh, wash so here it is like this just give it a nice shape as you require you can like this just maintain its tip part like this like this so after that just bring it here add some more loop cuts and just uh, um, shape it properly make it little like this like this as you can see now select these now press e and z for extruding it inside like this now as for scaling it add some loop to loop cuts again for making um, giving it a shape i am not adding much detail into it otherwise the video will be lengthy along which you also would not like that so 
I'm creating it just a simple model. Otherwise, you want to get in advance, so I will provide that video afterwards. Like this, just arrange it properly. As you can see, apply its mirror now. Arrange its thickness like this, so it is looking like much like a hand wash model product or means product like this. So after that you can see we have completed with our product modeling. Now it's time for uh, texturing it and rendering it. So first of all we have to take out its UV and wrap. So for that select this tube part. Mm -hmm. Now first of all press control 1 and just apply this subdivision set like this. Now just select these edges and mark seam it like this as we are unwrapping it. So, like this, clear this unwanted uh, edges like this by clearing the seam. Like this, all perfect from here, from here also just mark a seam. So you can see we have also unwrapped it. So for seeing that go to UV editing settings. Now from here you have to unwrap it. So you will find like this. Now let's add a texture onto it. So for the texture you have to download a texture. A particular texture from the Google. And just uh, go here. Go, uh, go to new and add a image texture into it. Then here from here you can select an image texture. Uh, which you want to apply on our model or product as you can see like this uh, just arrange it properly these parts so these parts will be in white color just make it little short and just keep it here now select this part as you can see this is a, uh, this is our front part of uh, our hand wash texture like this just, just Arrange it properly as you can see the differences in the layout like this. Like this. So as you, as you can see now for back part also do the same like this. Like this you can see. So after this. Just arrange it carefully. For getting of. Uh, really clean uh, results. Like this. So go to our layout. Now you can see from here. And just go to its uh, shading mode. And select these. Uh, the down part of it. Now just take a new material. And just give it the same color as it is. As you can see it is more darker than that now just arrange it from here by like this so you can see our model is also done modeling part is also done now let's render it so just arrange it metallic roughness and anything you like you can like this arrange it properly for getting the render results more clear and nice so here it is our model is done now just add a plane keep it a little down like this now give that plane any color you need like this now press shift d for duplicating that model just for making the render results more um, means attractive eye catchy you can say like this Like this now add an environment texture into it or uh, uh, otherwise you could also add uh, means lights uh, into it now for getting the render result just render it in cycles like this now just make it properly like this and so our render results will be more like this 
so as you can see bring your camera over here like this so this is our final part so here it is press f12 for getting the render results and yeah here uh, our modeling part is also done rendering part is also done so this was my quick tutorial on how to uh, model a product a uh, simple product so for beginners so here it is hope you like it and don't forget to save your blender file from here and thanks for watching my video bye and take care